and show you one more variety of a holder, such an interesting decorative one. I found it on one of the Czech sites. The author's name is Ilcha, if I have read it correct. At first I got the impression that I would not cope with it. But I have tried it, liked the result very much, and now I'd like to share it with you. I'm going to make it on such a small tray. I have woven it specially to try a holder on it. Insert the poles for our holder inside. The item has been varnished already, that is why the tubes don't get in very well. These two will be located at the sides and there have to be two more tubes on the base. So, we have to take three groups of tubes. Now, we take a regular tube and start weaving using the technique of a rope. One, wind round the group of tubes and one more time wind round. Now we lead the tube that has remained behind the left group of tubes crosswise. Wind it round, lead behind the next group and leave it looking toward us. The previous working tube. Now we lead it crosswise round the right group of tubes, lead it behind the middle one and leave. This working tube behind the left group of tubes, lead behind the middle one and toward us and continue this way, forming such a beautiful cross-like pattern. Lengthen the tubes and continue. One, hug the left group of tubes, lead behind the middle one and toward yourself. One, two, Three, lead round and toward yourself. Cross, one, two, lead behind the middle group of tubes, toward yourself. One, two, behind the middle one and toward yourself. The pattern seems complicated, but it is much easier in weaving than the two previous ones. It weaves rather fast, and the most important thing is that it comes out very beautiful. The following ones will be still smoother. I have mastered the pattern only recently, so it doesn't come out perfectly smooth yet. But it will become with time. And continue. Lengthen the tubes and continue weaving. At this side we have inserted the tubes in the same way and have made three groups of tubes. two groups of the base and the middle group of tubes in the middle. Then we have lengthened the tubes. Now let's connect them and form them in such a way to have three groups of tubes along the whole holder. The closest pin is bad, let's take a different one. Смотрим, чтобы более не неравномерное. Ну, можно тут и 
check the three groups of tubes to be more or less similar. Uh, we can use uh, glue, of course, but we can do without it as well. We have shaped the groups and continue weaving. Until we take the clothes spin away, we have to make an effort. Don't forget to press the tubes. I'd also like to draw your attention to the fact that the tubes of the base have to be rigid. Here I've tried to lengthen with softer tubes and the pattern fails a little. So I conclude once again that the tubes of the base have to be rigid, while the working tubes we weave with have to be much softer. and continue further. So we have finished weaving. Now we tuck the ticks uh, now we tuck the tips in carefully and cut them. Insert them somewhere inside carefully. Stretch and insert. Drop some glue here and here. I usually fix the joints with school glue and cut the extra tips. By tomorrow it is going to fit like a glove. The holder has come out rather decorative. We see that the holders can be very different. Here is the one like we did in our first lesson. Here is the variety of this very holder. In the first case we united the tubes and wrapped them around, while on this holder one can see that at first we were weaving like we do for a square bottom. Then we started twining the groups of two tubes with eight and finished in the same way of weaving. This one is our decorative weaving. This one is also a square bottom type. One can also make holders like this, but I don't think it is worth devoting a separate lesson to this topic because everything is clear without it. At first we weave, then leave several, for example, two or four poles, and weave the incomplete rows, from one and from the other side, and then continue on all the poles again. Very often one can see such holders on the leads. Here is just a regular loop. The tubes are interwoven and fixed here from this side neatly. And as a variety one can half a circle onto the loop. Good luck to all of you!